Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I know I'm in a different setup at the moment, but that's because we have construction workers. I have to do my child. Things are moved around today for you guys. We have construction workers here and they're re roofing, so it might be loud, but I'm just gonna go over my top favorite five highlighters from the drugstore for you guys. These are highlights that I have been using for a very long time, and um, I have I already filmed this video once and I accidentally deleted it. This is how the day is going. Anyway, so I'm just going to go ahead and show you guys my top fave five from the drugstore. Anyway, let me know down in the comments below um, if you guys use these highlighters at all or if you like them or if you dislike them and let me know what your favorite highlighters are from the drugstore as well. So the first one I'm going to talk about is the Wet n Wild. Highlight powder and I'll make sure I insert swatches for you guys because I want you to be able to see up close But this is what it is here. It retails for about $4.99. I do believe and this is um, This one doesn't have a name, but it's like the pinky But golden is actually the one that I am wearing kind of like all over my body right now But this is my favorite highlighter at the drugstore all times top 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 favorite And it's very affordable. It just has that nice wet glow and without having like chunky sparkles. So the next one is from Zip Physicians Formula. This is the butter highlighter. So they're like the butter bronzers, but a highlight version. So they still smell good and they're, oh man, a lot. Well, that just happens. Anyway, so that one's, I just broke, but um, anyway, it is a very pretty soft highlight um, that is, kind of wet to the touch and this one does have a little bit of glitter in it it's not terribly noticeable but if you are like not a fan of glitter whatsoever you probably won't like this one very much but I'm not a big fan of glitter in my highlight but this one I do actually like and it has that nice icy look to it and this is in the shade pearl it is a little more on the more expensive side I do believe it retails for about 14 15 ish dollars so it's a little more expensive but it smells so good and I think it's worth it next is a super really inexpensive one this is the essence pure nut nude sun lighter they have another one that's the sun glider or sun highlighter or something like that but this is the um, a little bit darker shade it is so pretty so fine I use this one on actually some of my brides because it has just that nice soft glow where it's not too harsh not too much so if you want a subtle glow with like not too blinding I would definitely pick this one up you can get it at Ulta or online um, but I do believe this one um, costs about a dollar ninety nine cents. So it's phenomenal. I love it so much. This is the Cody Airspun highlighter. Now these are newer um, to the drugstore. They ha um, you might know of Cody Airspun because they have a Cody Airspun powder that um, is pretty popular. It does have a scent to it, so people are about fifty fifty on that. But it's very inexpensive and it is a very beautiful powder. Um, but anyway, this is the highlighter that they make and it came out a couple months ago Or maybe last year and this is in the shade. It's no much ice So I think this one is the lightest shade I do believe they have three shades and this costs about three dollars between Two and three dollars. I do believe but it is such a pretty highlighter. It's icy. It's beautiful It has that nice glow and it's loose So if you've ever wanted to try a loose highlighter this one, I would highly recommend and a little bit of this one goes a long way. Next is another broken one. Now, you know these are much loved because they are broken. Um, this is the e.l.f. Baked Highlighter. I would show it up to you, but the powder would just go everywhere. Now, this one is in the shade of Pearl as well, um, just like the Physician's Formula one. I obviously have a theme when it comes to my highlighters, but this one costs $1.99. It is so inexpensive. The one of the best highlighters I've ever had and this I do believe is my first purchased highlighter I have ever gotten. I love this one so much. The thing about the baked highlighters is that you actually have to scratch off the top of the um, highlighter itself because it has kind of like a, I don't want to say waxy seal but something similar to that where you just kind of have to scrape it off and then you'll get that really nice glowy pigmentation and I also use this one on my brides as well. So. The two least expensive highlighters I have ever bought are ones I actually have in my bridal kit. 
I obviously keep the nicer one in the kit, but not the broken one. That's it for this video. I just wanted to um, sit down and actually film. It's been crazy at our house with the re-roofing and all that stuff. So I just still wanted to make sure I sat down and filmed this and got it done for you guys. Um, check out my other top fave five um, videos. I will have them linked down below in the description box. And let me know if you've tried any of these highlighters. And um, don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. And I will see you guys next Friday. Bye.